Surga. Hi guys, I wanted to build a much smaller house today. I was shooting for a starter home that would be under 20,000 simoleons, and I uh, really missed the mark by about half. So instead it's about $40,000, but it was still really fun to build, so I wanted to post it. This house has three bedrooms and just one bathroom and a nice uh, open space living room and kitchen dining room. I uh, adjust the outside walls a couple times even after I started decorating um, just to make room for certain things. Um, but the general shape really didn't change. I kind of had it in mind as what I wanted it to do. It has a nice little entryway that will uh, be attached to a porch you'll see me build here. I a fan of these angled walls, but in this case I thought it, it worked well, especially The porch is a really small porch, but it, it really adds to the effect and kind of brings that country home look to a much smaller, almost bungalow style house. The roof line is my favorite part of this house. Um, it's got I love the roof lines of this house particularly. It's got lots of different um, roof lines that kind of intersect and work together to really kind of make the house look bigger than it actually is. And it really adds to the, the country feel of the house. I did a uh, pretty fairly basic siding on this. I went with a brown color and added a little bit of trim to the edges um, to make it look kind of homey. I went for really simple doors and windows. I knew I wanted shutters on some of the windows. I ended up kind of switching it halfway between building this house later just so I can adjust for my furniture um, but it really makes it nice kind of a suburban looking home out of this country style there's a lot of good light in this house because it's small it's not too difficult to light um, the windows really do kind of work because the space There's not really an order to the way that I laid out the flowers. I just wanted that to kind of add to that country feel. Um, so it's kind of random and I kind of struggled with the trees. I, I'm still not sure I love how the trees are placed on this lot, um, but it works. I think the flowers, the little flower gardens really frame the house well and kind of draw your eye to the, the main parts of the house. The 
entryway, I just added an archway that leads right into the living area. I went with uh, wood floors throughout the house and then wood, half wood paneling um, and half wallpaper on, or paint on, on the top. I went with kind of a brown taupey color and then lighter ones in the bedrooms and more of a cool blue color uh, with the same paneling in the bathroom. I really don't love the lighting options that are in Sims 4, um, so I ended up changing it halfway through as well, but it works in this case. And I decided to go with this kind of brown gold theme uh, with kind of natural wood colors throughout the house, and I, I really do stay consistent with that in just about every room. So there's not a whole lot of difference in the uh, color choices of this house, um, but I really liked what, how it turned out. You saw I kind of moved windows around to accommodate my furniture, which is something that's really nice to do in Sims that you can't really do in real life. It's really a modern modern house on the inside. That's why I'm calling it a a, a modern country home. Uh, the insides are very modern, but but still have very much a contemporary or classic feel with with the uh, wood floors and the wood paneling on the sides. So here I am, I'm working on the kitchen now and had to adjust the windows one more time to fit where I was going to have the sink and, um, and make that work so that there wasn't any collision between the counters and the windows. I added a small two-person uh, counter, bar counter um, that, that really makes it, again, adds to the modern feel of this country home. Um, I didn't quite leave enough room for my dining room so I ended up adjusting the wall and I really struggled to make my uh, cabinets match my counters but I finally did figure that out. Like I said, I had to adjust the dining area to accommodate my dining table. I had meant to have that wall extend further out toward the street, but I um, had to do that later. These bedrooms are much smaller than I'm used to building. This house is much smaller than I used to build. I'm building. I really like to build much larger houses, but um, so I kind of struggled in organizing the, the bedroom furniture. I went very minimalist to make sure that everyone had a dresser and a mirror and a little bit of artwork. Um, so it ended up working out, but it was a challenge for me for sure.
last bedroom I work on is what I would consider the master bedroom. Um, it'll it has a it will have a door once I figure that out um, to the bathroom. Although the bathroom is shared between the other two bathrooms, um, it's the largest of the bedrooms. It's towards the front of the house, and uh, it's it's got the most space. With the very modern furniture in this one, all keeping with the same color scheme, like I mentioned, and uh, I really like the way this room turned out. The bathrooms are always my least favorite room to build in The Sims, um, just because there's not a whole lot of, well there are a lot of ways to do it, it's just it's much less interesting of a room to do for me. Um, this, this one worked out really easily. Finally, I rearranged the garden just a little bit. I um, moved to those planters towards the towards the corner of the lot, so they kind of drew you into uh, the entryway. And then finally I added a few more trees to the back to give it the lot some height um, above the house. And at that point I'm about finished with the house. I really like the way it turned out. It's really a simple, simple house. It's not quite a starter house, but it's a good one for Sims that are making a little money and, and wanting to expand a little bit. Um, there's room enough for a, a small family or or a group of people with a nice clean palette of color on the inside that easily be adjusted uh, to taste and I really 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 like the way this house how the way this house turned out so make sure you subscribe <laughs>